Okay, so I got a comment here on my videos again from these these people that want to see my real account. Um, go fuck yourself. I don't give a fuck. I'm not selling anything. Just stop fucking watching. Get the fuck out of my life. Really, just unsubscribe. I don't care if I have subscribers. I don't give a fuck about anything, man. I don't really give a fuck. That's why I'm trading. That's how I'm trading. And the people that are like, well, you know, you put your money offshore. Oh, yeah, well, you know what? You're not a risk taker. Why are you even fucking trading? If you can't risk putting your money, I mean, you're just scared, man. I mean, what is it? You want the, you want the Holy Grail? So Rainer Mary Relk. Relk. Well, you claim... People would steal your money when you show your real live account. I never said people would steal my money when I show my real live account. You remind me of the fake news people. Well, I, you take him. What I'm saying is that I like my privacy, and I have more than one account. And if I show my okay, this is well, I'm not going to show my real live account. Is I don't want somebody to steal my money. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't want people to hack into my account. Let's say that I didn't say steal before I said hack. Um, well, I just can't imagine. And so this fuck ha this fuckhead says, "Well, I just can't imagine you don't know how to hide your account number." Um, well, maybe you could tell me how to hide my account number in a real live stream. Like I'm gonna get out some fucking shit, and and keep. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a, a thing a, a photo over there. And I'm, I'm going to block out my real live account number. I don't know how to hide it, ass fuck. And if I hide it, listen to this fuckhead. If I hide it, people can go, well, I can't see your account number. I know it's real. I could actually, how about I do this? I will hack in and make it look like I'm trading a trading real live account. It'll say real and it'll say an account number. How's that? And then people say, well, can we see the account? How do we know it's a real account? I could make a fake real account. What is the point of this fucking questioning? I'm not selling anything. Go fuck yourself. If you don't like what I'm saying, get the fuck out of here. God damn it, man. Who are these fucking losers? Look at this fucking guy's site. Look at the shit he's watching. You don't believe you can make money trading. Everybody that says that to me, they don't believe they can make money trading. I, I know that's exactly what's going on. I've always believed you can make money trading. And besides, what, what the fuck? I had a fight with some guy. I uh, called him uh, Ricky Ricardo. This motherfucker, oh my God. Well, I just can't believe their system works. No, you can't believe that you can do it. And if I can do it, what the fuck you care if I can do it? You can't do what other people do. You can't play guitar like fucking Stevie Ray Vaughan. You could if you work real hard, but what's the fucking goal? You're going to play guitar like Stevie Ray Vaughan and go on tour? They're going to be, dude, you're copying Stevie Ray Vaughan. You want to copy my trades? This is what people want to do. There's such a this motherfucking loser. Well, if you're doing really good, can I copy your trades? Can I be like a Ryan Brown follower? The fuck is wrong with people? Dude, your fucking, your question tells me everything about you. You don't think you can make money trading. God, thanks for making me feel like I'm a, I'm a real trader. Because when I see it read something like this, I'm like, holy fuck. Look at this asshole. Uh, well, I just can't imagine. You don't know how to hide your real account number. Um, yeah, I'm not good at that, but I'm good at trading. I'm good at risking, okay? I'm a risk taker. That's why I'm on YouTube. I'm taking the risk of fuck nuts like you. The fucking hurt my, harsh in my melon. Don't be a fool or sell us for fools. I'm not selling anything, dude. And you are a fool. You're a fucking loser that's afraid to take a risk unless you can show me the holy grail. Oh, my God. Please don't just do it. Just say it. You don't have a real live account. Okay, I don't have a real live account. So what if I don't have a real live account? <laughs> I don't get it. 
What if I'm just nothing but somebody that does, does demos? How about that? Dude, I prefer that you think that. I prefer everybody thinks that all I do is demo. That's why I just show my demo account. Are you getting? A, are you figuring this shit out? I don't want to live in a fishbowl. I don't want to be like my public persona. Come join me. Come trade with me. I don't want a responsibility of an asshole like you. Oh, well, you know, we're in a drawdown. Well, now what? You're not winning every trade. You must not know what you're doing. Oh, really? Well, yeah. What kind of car did you buy? You got to put gas in it? Why does your car keep running out of gas? I thought that was an investment, your car. It seems like to me, I looked at the recent value of your car. It keeps going down in value. Why are you driving that car? Well, I have another car in storage that's going up in value. I don't think you do. I haven't seen you out driving that car. What the fuck logic is this shit? God, these cunts. Well, this is how you have 90% losing traders, 90% people lose at life. Listen, just so you let you know, 90% of small businesses fail. I wonder why that is. Let's see, we didn't sell. Oh, I designed the business about what I want, not what the marketplace wants. The marketplace, the market, the marketplace. What does the marketplace want? It wants to just do price. Oh, but I've got a Gartley. Can't they see my moving average? Has the market no respect for my 13 EMA? Whoa, these markets are manipulated. It's just not right what's going on here. I'm going to put the link to this fucking video for the answer to this cunt because I'm not going to type everything I'm saying here. I can talk a lot faster than I can type. And I'm not going to run spell check because I can't spell. I'm not going to run spell check. So, um, where are you, he says, so, um, don't just say it, you have a real account where you trade this kind of system, this kind of system. What kind of system is that? You mean something that's not mainstream? Like you fuck tur turds, like somebody has called me a turd, like you fuck turds trade. Well, we're waiting for the moving average crossover, and then we're going to buy a standard lot with a stop based on the ATR or 2% of my account. Really? You think you think a fucker, you think the bank does that? Well, what we do here is we have on deposit at the bank. You think the central bankers are going, you know what we're going to do here? Well, we see, see what we got going on here. We got um, how much how much money do we have uh, in the whole, every customer's account? Well, as Fargo probably does that. Well, we, Joe's going to put a trade on here, and he's going to use 2% of the whole equity of the bank account. Huh? And that's another fucking loser scheme of life. I'm risking 2% of my account. Okay, then get 10 accounts because you're going to fucking lose. On some, you lose when you pull the trigger, you fuckhead. I'm sick of this fucking shit. Well, as soon as you buy or sell anything in any fucking market, I don't care what the fuck it is. You either pay taxes, you pay the fee, you pay commission, you pay the spread, you pay the... Blah, blah, blah. Think about it, you fucking idiots, man. Get the fuck out of here, Rainier. Rainier. That's my real name. Wow, get a new one. How about Simpleton? <laughs> That's my real name, too. It's my real name. These are real accounts. So, um, where you trade this kind of system. What are you, a system racist? Oh, I only trade this guy. You make us believe it is so great. Oh, it's just so wonderful. Oh, gosh, buy low, sell high. Just such a wonderful idea. Let me see if that works. Just come here. How about I'll do it this week with a demo account? Oh, what's easy with the demo account? So if I blow up a demo account, I, I love this fucking loser logic. Everybody that's fucking criticizing me is just a complete loser cunt because they don't, they've don't they never traded. Or they have traded and they're losing and don't know why. Because I said, everybody that trades is a loser. So why were you asking that fucking question? The moment you step in the pool, you're taking a risk. Well, I'm not a risk taker. That's why I'm looking for the Holy Grail. I mean, you just blow your brains out with this shit. What the fuck you even want to trade for, Rainier? You're never going to make it as a trader. Oh, God, I'm losing week. <laughs> You'll quit. You'll quit. You know, I mean, it's just, you think there's some Holy Grail system. And you think I have it. 
I'm just showing how to execute trades, dude. You'll never make any money unless you can execute. Your, well, I'm not going to get in the market unless I know it's a good trade. Well, then don't get in the fucking... You never know it's a good trade. I'm showing you how to fucking think about the market and how to approach the fucking market. There's seven positions you can take in the market. <sighs> Buying a stop, buy at the market, buying a limit. There's three. Sell on a limit, sell at the market, sell on a stop. Those are tactical issues. Well, if you want, if you think the market's going down, want to just sell here. Well, maybe it goes up a little bit before it goes down. Why would you sell on a stop? I want to make sure it's going down. Or I want the momentum to, cr to crush through my orders. I'll take more risk. Or the seventh position, flat. And I suggest that to you. Don't fucking trade, asshole. Keep your fucking money in your mattress and shut the fuck up and get the fuck out of here. Um, I am not sure your system works in the long run. <laughs> Define the long run. Next four hours, next four days, next four years. This is a fucking hilarious comment in the long run. So Mark Douglas made money in the long run. People criticized him because he went filed bankruptcy. He must not know what he's doing. Um, I'm supposing this Rainier guy is wanting to learn stuff, so that's why, or he's curious, so he wanted to look out and seek stuff. I'm going to take a look at this, take a look at that. Okay, well, you're looking at it. Just look at that. So, you have to find a system that feeds, fits, fits, fits you. Maybe you want to trade stocks. Maybe you want to look for, like, trade penny stocks. Okay, do it. There is no holy grail. I'm running scripts. I'll show you how to execute. You can oversize the position. I don't even I don't think this guy understands. In the long run, if this science system works. And what do you mean by works? Makes a bunch of money? Or makes a little bit of money with a little bit of risk? The more you risk, the more you make. I'm showing people how to risk less and make more by using micro lots. This is something that came down the road. And when it first happened, when I was trading micro lots seven years ago, you couldn't put your, in some brokers, you could not put your order within 15 pips of current price for a stop or limit entry. You had to trade at the market. You, I mean, it's, the fear of missing out wasn't even, it was a fear. I mean, you had to have your orders. I know a guy in Britain, he's 10 pips away from current price. So he has, we, but why not put your limit 11 pips away? Fear of missing out. And fear of missing out is the biggest fear. Fear of losing is not so much of a fear. People go, okay, well, I put a stop in. I could lose on this trade. Um, so I'm not sure your system... It's my system. What do you care if it works in the long run? I'm not selling it to you for five grand like empowered fucking trading Gartley shit. But it but it works for the broker. Now listen to this fucking loser speak. It works works for the broker. Um what if I don't place a trade? And what if I am so fucking clever? I do put a, a buy limit 11.8 pips deep and get, get in at a good price. But it works for the broker. Well, you don't like brokers now? I love it when my broker makes money with me. With me. Okay. Or think of it this way, fuckhead. Are you going to walk around with 100,000 euros in a fucking briefcase and get on a plane and fly around trip for $5,000 to Europe. And then when you get to the bank and the market goes up 500 pips and you're like, you get to the bank and you go, 
uh, I'd like to exchange my euros. And they go, well, the spread on the euro is seven cents right now. That's 700 pips. So, sir, you have just lost 200 pips, pips plus airfare. Fuck you fuckers that think you're brokers. Like, get the fuck out of here. Well, it's really good. You know, you buy a car, it's really good for the manufacturer. He's going to fix it for, oh, it must be nice driving that car. Your, your, your car mechanic must love you. If you're going to clear a trade, dude, if you're going to trade big size, you're going to put out 100, if, you're gonna, if your spread's two and you're going to buy 100,000 uh, euro, you're down 20 bucks out of the gate. You got to make that up. So either you don't trade, Rainier, Rainier doesn't trade, or he does. And he's like, wow, my broker's making all the money here. I'm losing. Yeah, it's like when you go to the shrink and they don't cure you. Yeah, they're, 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 they're happy to have people that are constantly out of their fucking mind. They're making money while they're not even having to cure you. At least the brokers just doesn't even fucking really give a shit. They're just clearing your trades. Next thing you're going to tell me, you, you don't like uh, the central banks because they're manipulating the market. <laughs> yeah, that's how you make money. Manipulation. What, do you want the market to stand still? It'd be a lot safer if it did. I wouldn't get stopped out. I mean, let's think of the fucking logic. <laughs> the fuck, man? How do these people even get down to fucking make it to the interwebs? But it works for the broker, he says. With all the spreads you pay to them. Well, you forgot about the commissions. All the spreads you pay to them. They are pretty happy, I assume. Unlike you. I hope that helps you. So, get the fuck out of here.